everyone, welcome to Pager Budgets. My name is Priscilla and welcome. Today I'll be doing my sinking funds update. I'll be counting all my sinking funds and writing the end balances for them. But yeah, let's just get started. I have everything, all my envelopes here. I decided to take them out. And new car doesn't have anything. It's all in the bank, which is $2,000. So I'm just going to write that here. Alright. And for Mexico, we started with 112. And we have... One, two, three hundred. And savings, we started with a hundred and twenty, and we have a hundred fifty. So not much of a difference there, but still saving. So 150. And the ones I write in blue are kind of my priority ones. Um, savings is not much of a priority anymore. When I first started, it was kind of a priority, but now that I added... Um, some saving challenges. I don't think it's necessary to save a lot on that one. But yeah. Birthdays. We started with 38. And now we have 50. And it's the only one bill we have in there. So 50. School. We started with 88. And we have 150. Our maintenance, we started with 127, and it's at 150, 200. Student loans started with 23, and it has 30 now. Student loans is not... A priority to be honest so yes $30 student loans wedding we started with five dollars and now we have ten and it's all it's in there Oops, sorry ten dollars in there Taxes started with 10 in the house of 20. Rent started with 40 and has 50. Struggling. 50. Wait. Sorry. Texas has 20. Ren has 50. Okay. CJ started with $35 and now he has 50. 100. His birthday is coming up in September, so I want to make sure I have enough money for him. And this is my fiance's name. So he has a hundred now. An emergency we started with two hundred and twenty and now we have a hundred, two hundred, two fifty, three hundred. My goal is a thousand dollars, so I guess I'm a quarter done. Put three hundred in there. 
Okay, and Familia started with $82. And now it has $100, $200, $300, $400, $450, $500. Okay. Tattoo started with uh, two dollars, and now it has fifty one, two, and three. Fifty three dollars. I really want to get a tattoo soon, so that's why I'm starting to add a little bit more. I used to only put a dollar because it wasn't a priority. It's still not a priority, but I just really want to get a tattoo. And that had 50, oops, sorry. And that had 53. How started with, oh, this is travel. Um, did I do this wrong? Okay, house. Oh, I think I skipped travel. Okay. So let's just do travel right here. I don't know how much I started with travel. Six dollars. Alright. Alright, travel. Started with six dollars and now it has fifty, fifty-five, fifty-six. And house started with four dollars and now it has fifty, fifty one, fifty two, fifty three, fifty four. Fifty four. Shopping we started with three dollars and now it has twenty twenty five. And shopping. All right, twenty five. Pidgey budget started with zero dollars, and now it has twenty. <coughs> Excuse me. Twenty dollars. Health started with five dollars and it has twenty five. Self care started with zero. Let me just write down twenty five on health. Self care started with zero and now it has twenty five as well. Now for my 52 week challenge, I started with 136 and now we have 50, oops, 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 231. $231 in my 52 week challenge. As I've mentioned, I'm also doing my uh, $100 or not $100. The one I'm also doing the 100 envelope challenge. But for the 100 envelope challenge, I'm not like doing it as much as I would like to just because 
it's kind of harder for me with my income. The one I do not want to fall behind and the one that I am doing every week is the 52 week challenge just because I feel like it's a little bit more manageable for me unlike the 100 envelope. But the 100 envelope I am keeping track in this little book right here. I, don't know you, oh, I think I just broke it. As you can see we have 157. Oh, I put travel all the way down here. All right, well, I'm gonna. Okay, oh well. Anyways, my 100 envelopes, I just keep in this ugly box <laughs> that I got a package in, but yeah. And I just put the ones that I'm done in here. And I do have a few that I've picked out that I haven't been able to stuff but whenever i am going to stuff this i have a few that are already picked out and these are all the ones i've already done oh i don't know what that is but so those these are the ones i've done so they're not a lot like one two three four five six seven i've only done seven envelopes but yes, it's just not, it's, I like it, but right now with my income, I'm low income, so it's not realistic for me to do this all the time. But hopefully, eventually, I'll be done with this. My goal is to do it in a year and a half for the, I guess, yeah, I don't know. I just want to be done with this soon, but I know I won't, so. But yeah, now I'm just going to add all of these up and I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the total amount I saved in the month of May. And honestly... This is only because of my tax return and obviously the stimulus and all of that. So, I was behind. I got both my 2019 and the stimulus checks late because my 2019 tax return was, it didn't get, um, so I filed it like in 2020, like the beginning of 2020, like on time before tax were due, but it did not get, um, I don't know how to say this how to put it in words basically they did not process it until this year so I got it this year so that's why I stuffed them in May because I got them super late but yeah there's that and what does it look like that like in person it's not doing those weird lines but on camera it is that's so weird anyways I'm gonna write down the total right here I don't know if it's I'm gonna have to rewatch this and see if the lines are showing but anyways that's my total and yeah I don't really care for the balances to be honest I don't want to make this video too long I just mainly wanted to count them and write down the balance and see how much I saved which is kind of crazy honestly but 2,000 of these are in the bank yes <laughs> I can't even talk I'm just over here like that's kind of a crazy number but anyways that is it for today. I hope you enjoyed this. I know it's kind of like a shorter kind of, I don't know. I'm not very good at recording these kind of videos. Um, but yeah, I hope you still enjoy it and have a nice day. Thank you for watching.